Oklahoma man is demanding answers after he says the Oklahoma County Jail lost his belongings after he was booked. News 4's Bria Berry picks up the story from there. It's new tonight. I just want my stuff, period, and I want to be left the hell alone. This man, who goes by J Knight, spending more than 24 hours in the Oklahoma County Jail for driving under the influence. Knight says in order to get released, though, he was forced to sign a form stating he didn't have any personal belongings. I had two iPhones. I had an iPhone 13 Pro Max Gold. I also had another iPhone, and I had my wallet that had all my identification cards in it. He also says he had to turn in his keys during his intake process. And now he claims no one knows where his personal items are. They said that I didn't come in with nothing, so I had to check no if I wanted to get released out. Knight says someone from the jail told him to contact Oklahoma City Police. But when he went to the department on Monday, he had no luck. I had to break in my own house. That's crazy. We reached out to the Oklahoma County Jail to try to get some answers, and we were told the property release process can take up to 30 days to investigate. Then after that, someone can file a tort claim. But for Knight, it's a headache he believes could have been avoided. The last thing I heard was um, it might take 30 days. I'm like, that's, no, I don't have 30 days. I have an employer. I have a job that needs, the, you know, that I need to show proper, you know, documentation. In, In Oklahoma City, Bria Beery, Oklahoma News 4. Now, he's talking about the county jail, but the Oklahoma City Police Department told us the recently released inmates' property was not confiscated by them.